Well, over three years ago, the Hawaii Super Ferry went belly up, leaving the state on the hook for tens of millions of dollars that went to harbor improvements and docking barges. Now, while the state is hoping to get some of that money back, the state auditor says that number is going up. KITV4's Paul Drews explains. Yeah, this is the hook for the, for the line, for the catch fish. Hawaii's long line fishermen are getting ready to reel in their next catch. But before they face the challenge of the open ocean, they have a challenge just getting out of Honolulu Harbor. The boat is getting on the block on our, our way. You know, it's a it hard time for in and out on that one. The three docking barges built for the Hawaii Super Ferry operations are moored at Pier 19, crowding other ships in this corner of the harbor. We don't have room for a for block over here. The state isn't losing money by having them moored here because the harbor isn't full, but occasionally thousands of dollars are spent to move the docks around to accommodate other ships. Then there's the cost to make sure they stay moored here. That comes on top of the state's initial write-down of $41 million in bonds, for the barges and harbor improvements for the super ferry. And according to the state auditor, that number will go up. By the time those bonds are paid off, and all the other expenses are added in, will probably come up to about $63 million cost to the state. The state could get some of that money back if the docking barges are sold. DOT was planning to try to sell them, but um, they haven't maintained them, so they're, they're rusting out there in the harbor. As you can see, these three docks are rusting, but they're still afloat. And after three years, the state says it's working hard to get rid of them. In fact, according to the Department of Transportation, selling the barges is a priority for the Harbors Division, which has several interested parties in the docks. But a federal statute could sink a sizable return of the state's investment. Because of the Jones Act, the barges could not be used for business in the United States without an exemption. But local parties could still buy the docks for scrap. At Honolulu Harbor, Paul Drews, KITV4 News. The state plans to hold an auction of the docks, which could be used as barges, but no date or details of that auction have been set yet.